Hi, yes. What is the proper definition of probable cause, possibly in a stop and frisk situation or any situation? Probable cause, buddy. I mean, I mean, I'm, I'm sorry. Well, what's, the, what's the definition of probable cause? And we're going to take us back to our first year of law school. Here. Sure. Well, I mean, so. well, probable cause essentially is, mm -hmm. is does an officer have probable cause to believe that you have committed, are committing, or about to commit a crime? Uh, probable cause is a very low standard. Uh, everyone is aware, for the most part out there, that you know, it takes proof beyond a reasonable doubt in a court of law to prove someone uh, guilty of a crime. But the threshold for probable cause, that is what uh, an officer has to establish in order to make an arrest, is much lower. I mean, you, you've, got, you've got probable cause down here and proof beyond a reasonable doubt up there. So there, it's, uh, it's drastically different. And people shouldn't believe that just because they were arrested that uh, there's no doubt, doubt but that if they were to challenge this in a court of law that they would be convicted.